This biochemistry video, we're going to work on figure 17.3 from Leninger's Principles of Biochemistry textbook. Specifically, we're discussing the mobilization of triglycerides in adipose tissue. So, how does this happen? Well, in conditions of low blood glucose, glucagon is released and it binds its receptor. This is step one. I think it's easier to learn if we make this a step-by-step -step process. So this stimulates adenylyl cyclase to produce cyclic AMP. And when this happens, PKA is activated and it phosphorylates hormone-sensitive lipase, HSL, and perilipins that are located on the surface of the lipid droplets in the adipocyte. This leads to the disassociation of CGI protein from perilipin, which then associates with adipose triacylglycerol lipase, or ATGL. ATGL is activated and leads to the conversion of triacylglycerols into diacylglycerols and free fatty acids. Then the phosphorylated perlipin associates with uh, phosphorylated HSL, hormone sensitive lipase, and this allows the hydrolyzation of diacylglycerols into monoacylglycerols and free fatty acids. Then monoacylglycerol lipase, another lipase, uh, hydrolyzes these monoacylglycerols into free fatty acids and glycerol. Free fatty acids can then leave the adipocyte. They bind to albumin and are carried to other tissues through the blood. In this case, uh, we're going to take the example of the myocyte so they, or the muscle cell. So they enter the myocyte uh, via a fatty acid transporter where they are oxidized to CO2. And the energy of oxidation powers the contraction of muscle and fuels other processes of myocyte energy metabolism. One last thing to point out is that the glycerol released by lipase action is converted by phosphorylation and oxidation to dihydroxyacetone phosphate or DHAP and can be used in glycolysis or gluconeogenesis. Alternatively, glycerol 3 phosphate can be used for lipid synthesis. All right, this is it for this video. In the description, you'll find an image copy of this final illustration. Uh, feel free to download and use it. If you enjoyed this video, please hit the like button and subscribe. Thank you for watching.